Hello friends, uh, welcome back to High Tech Institution video channel. So in this you know YouTube channel, we are discussing many useful contents. Again, uh, in this playlist, this is video number two. So we all know uh, in this playlist, right? We are planning to make somewhere around 10 videos purely with respect to AWS and DevOps job opportunities. And uh, here, not only covering the job opportunity, when we wanted to you know seek for a better job, uh, we should be in a position to have a proper uh, profile and resume to be updated. And also, we need to highlight proper skill set, whichever peak in today's uh, you know industry and what is there in uh, live projects. In addition to that, we should know uh, how to uh, seek for the correct job. Okay, how to identify a right job for our right profile. So these are the three major bullet points uh, we are being discussed in this uh, video series. So I'll take you to video. Before that, uh, whoever watching this video, right, I'm strongly recommending all of you to go and give one like to this video and share with your friends. Okay, by the way, uh, you know, mothers also will be getting benefited. And I want all of you to subscribe my channel. Okay, that is really highly I'm requesting all of you. So if you need any further videos also, please mention in the comment section. Okay, fine. Now we'll get started. All right, guys, uh, in the last video itself, I have explained how the uh, Nokuri profile have to be created. Of course, in this uh, series itself, we are going to also discuss about um, uh, LinkedIn. Okay, in upcoming videos, how to update the LinkedIn profile. But uh, as of now, we are discussing the Nakuri profile. So last week, right, I have uh, discussed up to up to the uh, uh, Nakuri, what are the portion need to be updated. If anyone missed that video, right, I have mentioned that in the description. Go ahead and have a look on it. Then you will get a continuation of this video. Okay, here in the Docker, right, in the skill set, I have mentioned all those things which are very, very you know, crucial today. Uh, most of the recruiters, right, they are searching for the candidate with this uh, updated skill actually. So I mentioned Docker, Kubernetes, and Terraform, uh, DevOps, uh, GCP Cloud, and Azure uh, DevOps, AWS, Ansible, GitHub, Jenkins. These are the core and peak technologies. So as this is all the content that right, I have updated as per my experience and my exposure. So I'm, you know, uh, requesting all of you to go and uh, pick uh, the technology, whichever you are really familiarized and which we are, we are really, you know, good in your uh, uh, area. So see, I am a multi-cloud expert. That is the reason I have updated all three cloud, AWS, Azure, GCP. But I am not recommending all of you to go with that until when you know any, when you're not knowing any technology. Okay, I know Docker, so I have updated. I know Kubernetes, I have updated. I know Terraform, I have updated. So, in meantime, right, make sure you are not updating all the content, bunch of content, like, you know, anything. The recruiter will not be able to identify. It became, you know, a scam. So, many people are doing wrongly. So, do not, you know, update all the each and every services. So, update on high level, very important tools and services, right? Try to cover as much as possible. Okay. That this is the another hint I would like to give in this video. Uh, yeah, of course, as usual, once I gave the hint to update our profile, I will take you to the uh, job opportunity uh, here uh, today right i am going to review the job which comes for aws cloud architect this is something from cdna global okay this is something from the company called the cdna global over here they are uh, looking for the candidate who have a 10 to 12 years of experience okay so they are hiring location going to be bangalore so of course uh, you can check whether any option to available for the different location uh, permanent remote and work from home uh, both are possible okay that's fine now that is not a matter at all when you go for uh, checking a job right you should go through the job description before you go to apply that particular job so most of the time right i i hear the same feedback from the candidate i, I actually take training whenever i take training i'll have a many candidate i used to interact with hey hurry i'm applying per day 10 to 15 job in not daily basis but i'm not getting the call the problem is uh whatever the profile skill set you have updated right that should match with the job description has been given in every company whenever they are posting any job requirement your profile requirement recruitment uh, profile update should match with the uh, roles and responsibility and the desired candidate profile right it both should match only then you will get the response so blindly giving 10 20 job whatever you are seeing blindly if you giving 10 to 12, 15 daily request to any company right again you will profile mark less a scam you won't get any call from the recruiter you have to maintain your profile well and neat automatically calls will be coming and now i'll explain about this roles and responsibility about this particular profile okay you will get some idea whether to go with this job opportunity or you can search for a different one okay so see in this company when you clear the interview what will be your roles and responsibility see 
develop customer intimacy to fully understand their technical and business requirement as well as multi cloud roadmap uh, business case for the change uh, deliver uh, triangle you know uh, tenable tra plan actually tenable plan all right so here right uh, you are supposed to work for the customers uh, end to end uh, their technical uh, problems and the solution and uh, whatever their business need available right in the uh, multi cloud environment you need to work there will be a roadmap they have given okay all the case studies you have to involve uh, scope each customer engagement with attention towards clear and well defined objectives and success criteria all right so the scope uh, for the uh, engineer right who are working everything is well defined and they are maintaining the process okay clear process we need to adopt with that process and we need to work according to their criteria actually okay own at each technical engagement and help ensure timely and successful deliver of value uh, yeah, of course these are the small small point they have mentioned in the roles and responsibility this is no much you no know, relevant to our content they have mentioned everything on the process oriented capture and share the best practices knowledge among the solution architect community okay they have a community we need to bring out the whatever the previous experience what have uh, good experience good problem solving if anything knowledgeable we need to document it understand the amazon web service market uh, you know uh, segments uh, customer based and industry vertical so which are the area people are using amazon web service what are the customers are using so all those information they are you know asking us to be ready with but decided candidate profile this is really matters actually this is you know then and there you know you don't want to be you know 100 fit into this criteria but coming to the desired candidate profile right this is really really they are expected one and this is how your job and interview will be okay experience in large data center migration cloud to cloud hybrid migration strategy you should you know this i think they are these are the people really looking for the migration expert i believe even though you're not expert at least you should have some knowledge okay try to have a knowledge on migrations okay so nowadays almost everybody asking there are many third party tools are there go ahead and have a migration knowledge and the strategies what are the different strategies are there in migration we have a various steps involved okay try to have a high level idea about that uh, migration if you give very good uh, input uh, during the interview if you give cleared at maximum point in other sections if you are even if you have a very limited knowledge in migration high level knowledge also they will believe on you they will take you there may be a chances are there okay i experience with this personally experience architecting or deploying cloud virtualization solution in enterprise customer aws specific experience required okay you should know you should have the uh, good uh, experience on architecting cloud and uh, hypervisor based virtualized solution for the bigger enterprise customer okay for the bigger enterprise customer so that is really you know important experience architect install the solution using both the linux nx and windows with the specific recommendations server load balancing uh, ha dr storage architectures so you should have a, a strong knowledge on linux as well as windows platforms okay and you should have a load balancing idea okay various types of load balancer if you work down you know high availability and disaster recovery storage architecture that is you know added benefit to your uh, profile hands on experience on cloud formation template and nowadays almost everyone asking terraform or cloud formation try to be expertise on any one tool okay if you are expert in both the tool really really good actually spinning up and spinning up and automating infrastructure okay using lambda or boto3 if you are you know good in automating try to have that knowledge as well aws aws account hardening okay for the best practice nowadays as per their standard you know hipaa standard other things and all nowadays people are doing the hardening of their account and the operating system everything you should have a knowledge on that process as well okay experience in writing well designed microservices architecture okay so if you have a, a very good uh, you know idea and kubernetes and now microservice architecture is defined that is added benefit good knowledge and experience with ci cd pipeline this is common almost any job uh, uh, interview if you take and describe the profile right ci cd play a crucial role familiarization okay here you don't want to be you know proper hands on just if you have a familiarization with the aws services as cloud front elastic cache amazon s3 bean stack dynamo db containers etc is uh, desirable so if you have a knowledge on this idea add a benefit that on same time not mandatory uh, even they said not mandatory try to have uh, some reference okay what is cloud front what is elastic search just to have a uh, what is what uh, definition try to understand it okay with small small example 
experience in working open stack and aws management consoles so you should have a knowledge on uh, open stack even if you're not having open stack knowledge at least go and manage aws management console you need to know in and out option what is there in aws console how to open this service where to create support case how to check the billing all those things right it's good for you to have and get and bash script okay whatever go with that in addition to that what and all good to have skill enterprise application and database architecture and the multi cloud experience if you have multi cloud means that is really really good experience in terraform azure arm python see we have a cloud formation right similarly azure has arm azure resource manager okay if you have a knowledge in that that is really good so end of the day it looks like a different different tools but again all of them are doing the same work minor syntax changes are there rest all going to be exactly same cloud formation terraform azure arm everything python okay try to have a boto3 knowledge along with python and jenkins aws code pipeline if you know jenkins clearly code pipeline we can manage experience in setting up the control tower and landing zone you should know uh, nowadays account new account creations are happening automatically okay nowadays new account creations are happening automatically if we have that knowledge right that is really you know important and matters container and orchestration knowledge okay container and uh, orchestration knowledge that is another uh, important if you have kubernetes knowledge and all that's really, really good actually linux administration okay uh, perks and benefits uh, so your role going to be solution architect it's purely into it and consulting okay education qualification if you are good in these are the skill set right see what the skill set i have shown in the previous tab if this is matching with your uh, skill set uh, this job will be uh, relate to you then you can go ahead you can apply all right so fine guys i hope you got some information about this job requirement and uh, by watching by, by keep on watching this video right you, by referring different different companies job requirement you will came to know uh, what is the currently company's expectation everything so by the way also you can update your profile all right fine so the people who like this video at least give a like symbol and share with your friends i want all of you to subscribe this channel if you need any other specific video on specific topic right i'm strongly recommending all of you to put that uh, um, information in the comment section so i'll prepare the video on that particular topic okay so fine guys thanks again for watching this uh, channel and this particular video okay uh, so let me meet you on that video number three thank you everyone take care bye bye